can hear the music from the cafe, but I'm off work today. It's one o'clock and I'm currently trying to make our room look a little bit nicer. Our room is really nice, like, I love it. Um, but it just looks very organized over here. In Clara and my little area. I just changed my bed sheets as well. They used to be like all gray and black, but I find these really nice blue ones. So I took them with the white pillows. So that already makes it look better. And then we found these and I was thinking if they go in here, that would be great. I'm gonna try that and then sort all this stuff out. I think it's Clara's, but I'm gonna try. And then we found this. It's like a hangy thing. I guess you could hang shoes in it or whatever. I forgot to drink this. Sorry about the music in the cafe. Um, this was the raw organic electrolyte infusion drink. It was supposed to be purple blue. It's purple as you can see. Blueberry aside. Mm. Wow. That's actually so nice and refreshing. Oh my god. It's not too sweet or anything like that. Recommend, recommend. <laughs> o'clock i'm really tired today i slept until like 11 30 but i just thought that i'd go out for a little walk because i'm working two until six and i'm not working out today because workout time is six so i'll do tomorrow morning with lil yeah it's a little bit colder so this is what i'm wearing i'm just gonna listen to a podcast and walk <laughs> the weather is pretty shit right now but it's not cold at least. I just took my cardigan off. Which I actually start work in an hour and 20 minutes. So, but yeah, I'm going to a little park. Maybe I'll get a coffee, we will see. So I'm here now at Chevron Island in this little park, which is really nice. Like, this is a nice bench that we could come and have like picnics on or something. It doesn't look amazing just because of the weather, but it is a cute little park and I got an iced almond latte. I asked for soy, but I got almond, but I really like the almond latte, so that's fine. Lean Chef Kitchen, I got this from. And they've opened like so you can dine in or you can dine outside their, their window, which is nice. Hello everyone, it is a Thursday, currently like 20 minutes past 12. It's the 21st of May. Uh, this morning we got up at nine o'clock for a workout with Lil. Our little personal trainer at the hostel honestly love him to bits and everything he does for us it's just so nice for him yesterday i booked a table at a restaurant called the collective not sponsored or anything like that i'm just really excited to go to a restaurant again because now they're finally letting in 10 people at a time um and this restaurant looks so nice so we booked a table for seven we're going tonight at eight o'clock and i'm just so excited for that so i thought i'd bring you along today um, right now we're just going to Woolies to do a food shop. We're in desperate need of groceries, like we have nothing. So I'll probably do like a big grocery haul for you guys as well. Because they can be interesting, right? Um, so yeah, it's an interesting day. I'm working at two o'clock, so I've got a little bit of time before I need to start work. This is what I'm wearing. These are my new jeans from Cotton On. Uh, they have stretched a bit, which is nice. I cut them off a bit as well. This is my Sarah cardigan. My necklace is from Louisa. I lost my little wave ring, which I'm so sad about. Lightning bolt earrings are from Safira as well. And so these, they used to be gold, but they've lost their color. And this is my Danielle Wellington watch. Also, this is how the drawers ended up. It ended up really, really good. Like it is so clean now compared to what it used to be. And this thing has helped us. Like we've got shoes there. It's nice. And that's how it looks up there doing our little food shop for once we've decided to get a big trolley which was a good idea this is our shopping list it could change so we're back from the grocery store we spent like 85 dollars i think 
First of all, we just got these corn thins. We always get them. Soy, linseed, and chia. You just eat them for breakfast. We've got a packet of tomatoes, broccoli. We got red kidney beans. Love making like burrito bowls. Garlic, always essential. Like a mushrooms, really nice to have. I fry it with some onions. We've got this six pack of avos. We've got three carrots to make like a little stir fry. This big value pack of spinach leaves, baby spinach. We've got these organic um, shredded coconut for a smoothie bowl. We've got date and tahini sauce, never tried it before. Instead of like a honey to have as a topping on your smoothie bowl or something, there's no added sugar in it. It's vegan. Strawberries, three little bananas. Mainly we just use frozen bananas, but it's nice to have some fresh ones as well. We've got three packs of almond milk, chickpeas, no added salt, lentils. And we got this classic tomato pasta sauce. It was only $1.50, super cheap, classic tomato sauce. Frozen raspberries and frozen mango. We got some Greek yogurt. Oh, I didn't say, but this is Clara and my groceries, so it's not like just me. We got some more chia seeds. Got this, because it was only $1.50, really good deal. This is the brand Tasty Smushed Whole Food Balls, peanut butter and caramel. Zucchini. Some grapes, some cheese, some lemon. We are in on the bus. God. So we're at the restaurant and Emma and I are sharing a knocky truffle pasta mm -hmm. that looks amazing. And this veggie truffle pizza that shine my light on it. Oh my god. Yeah. And we got espresso martini and So it's the next day. Our dinner yesterday was lovely. How did you find the dinner? Very nice. It yeah. was amazing. It was <laughs> almost worth the two month wait. Um, but today I had off. It's a Friday. So Tanya and I are going to Karambin. I've never been there before. I'm going to go and check it out. So we're here now at Service Paradise. We're on the G tram and we're going down here, Karambin. We have arrived. The wildlife sanctuary was closed though. So now we're just gonna check out this rock. It's like a lookout. We're on Elephant Rock Lookout. dead crab r.i.p so many surfers and this is karambin rock <laughs> it's not that much to see here it's nice though my lens is so dirty oh i'm recording so since there wasn't much to do and see in karambin we decided to take the bus to kulangata um, because it looked quite close on the map, but it was a 30 minute bus ride, but our bus driver drove straight past us and he saw us. So we ended up just getting an Uber here, it took like 12 minutes. And now we're at this place called Raw Energy and we just ordered some lunch or something to eat. I got a Snickers bowl, I'm so excited about it. We're really close to the border as well, so we have to make sure to stay on the right side, otherwise they'll check us. <laughs> This is my Snickers bowl. It is huge. It looks amazing. And Tanya got this juice and a Snickers bite. It looks good. It's so beautiful here. I just had that smoothie bowl and it was amazing. And now we're just going to walk to Snapper Rocks and just explore the beaches here in Kulangata. The sun's coming out a little bit. Down here we have snapper rocks and like the rock pools. So this is where like the surfing competitions would be. We are so close to the border. I think those tall markings over there are like an indication of where the border is. We're on our way back now and we're literally walking next to the border. Like the other side of this road is New South Wales. It's 
so that's fun. New South Wales, Queensland. <laughs> oh my god, we crossed the border. This is on the inside. Queensland. So that is the end of this vlog. I know it was a little bit short, but I hope you enjoyed it anyway. If you aren't following my socials, please do. I post every Sunday. So yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.